Here we go. LeBron James. What more can you say about the guy that hasn't already been said? He can play anywhere on the court. And he gets it done on both ends like nobody else in the league. If we can't slow him down, this game could get out of hand real quick. It's going to be one of the biggest tests of the season for me, that's for sure. Time to step up. Well, I mean, luckily for you, you don't have to actually guard him. Hopefully you won't have to. Otherwise, I'm going to get destroyed. A look at the east over downtown Phoenix, Arizona. Still glowing in the evening twilight.
We're gonna bring you an interconference matchup in this All right, the let's do this. Don't care. Watch this play. I increased the time to 10 minutes. And do we have a present for you today? I'm Kevin Hart. He excels at knocking down free throws, don't gamble on blocks and steals when the ball is in his hands. Good at finishing inside around the basket when his feet are set, use L2 to body him up and force him out of the paint. Weaknesses, he struggles to defend players with the ball, press L1 to call for the screen and get yourself a good look on offense. He's not known for his stealing ability, hold or flick our right stick to put him on his heels and take him off the dribble. Gotcha, Mo Williams. Phoenix Suns come into this one following a loss to the Philadelphia 76ers. Yeah, they were in a funk from the field in that game. Credit the defense, though, because even when they Yo, hit me. open looks, no rhythm or no. to knock them down. Hey, guys. Hey, every team has a night like this. Ah, oh, okay. come on. We call them gong games. You just want to hit the gong, forget about them, and move on. And so in the game for the Cavaliers, Thompson and Verge at the 4-5. and five. Williams is out there with Smith. And it's there we Thompson go. In at the three, the small forward. Clinton what do you? With a very strong I should have just went up with the. A very solid team on the road oh my God. Led teams on the yeah, he's a special guy. Uh, Devin Booker, so trash. Uh, didn't start out hot on the road, but eventually got it together and ended up 22 and 19 away from home. I also changed my jersey number to 22. Because I like 22 more than 8. Dang, we're nowhere. We're not in there. Yikes. Doesn't look like we'll be making the postseason. Oh my god. How? Why does my teammate go down, but like down by that much just for getting my shot blocked? And why does it switch? Are you? Oh my god. Are you serious? This is so dumb. Is not one that can sustain any kind of success in today's NBA. And back to the Cavs. If you can't shoot threes, why are you at the three point? A lot of new players coming in can struggle early. It's especially evident when playing on the road. And it's freak missing. The Cavaliers trail by three. Here's Verizon. I swear to God. Oh my God. Picks up the assist. Verizon's got his first two points. He has. Why does nothing ever go right when I get put in? They've got to figure out a way to get a bigger body on him because if they don't match up his size, then he's going to continue to work him over the rest of the game. Lawrence. They can't. How is that a D? Um. Mm. Talk about being streaky on the road. That's what the Cavs were. I mean, could rattle off four. Why am I guarding Verizon? Then come back empty from their next road trip. They did seem, though, to get stronger and more steady as the season went on. Right side, Jefferson. Shot clock at five. He's gonna, he's gonna make the shot. Tries from ten. And oh wow! They actually you missed. Know, they don't score on that shot, but they're gonna be happy with those kinds of possessions. And there we go. That was nice. That was a good setback. Chance here, Kevin, to see where the Cavaliers. They can't guard us on the perimeter. Spread the floor and isolate up top. Spacing, fellas. Third in the league. Spacing. Spacing. And you talk about scoring. Just listen to coach. Spacing. At all levels. Every time you get a bucket, they're coming right back at you with one of their own. And the Suns making a change here. Sims has checked in. Smith kicks to Verizon. Oh. Stolen by Len. It's three on three on the fast break. Booker. This is it to Freak. From beyond the okay, yard, I'll take it. Another three for Phoenix. Hey. And a closer look here at the hustle stance for the I didn't think I was going to be that wide open. They've really amped up the pressure at the defensive end, guys, and have piled up the steals in the early going. And also, defensively, they've been able to oh, awesome I'm out. tonight. And, and that also builds confidence. In yeah. Team. And unfortunately, we've seen a few too many of those. A lack of concentration and alertness, a turnover, and an easy bucket the other way in transition. And really, a few more of those in this game. All right, we got eight points now. Smith kicks to Williams. Oh god. Molly Williams is number 52. What? Is that actually his number this year? 
It's a really random number. Ah. Come on, JR. There's 39 seconds left to play here. Wow, dude, good screen. Tucker, the pass to Sims. Booker up top, out left to the wing. Ah, should have shot that. Shoots it up, and it does wow. even draw iron. <laughs> That's exactly he airballed. How you have to defend him. That's He's embarrassing. The that the D needs to be aware of at all times. Here's Williams. Looking at his point production, he averages almost eight points a game. What's up a three? The shot, no good. Ah, uh, that should have been. Oh yeah, you pass it to me. Wow. Yeah, nice job of setting the screen by his teammate there, and I'm sure he appreciated. it. And a chance to hear All right, let's go. LeBron James as he talked about the challenge of remaining calm and collected throughout the ups and downs of the NBA season. LeBron James. For me, at a younger age, I was never even kill. We would win a playoff game when I was younger. I was excited out of my mind, and then you would lose, and I was the worst person in the world. But I think at this point in my career, I kind of stay even. One game shouldn't affect the next game. You know, you go out and play as hard as you can, live with the results. Again, just true, true, true. That's a def definitely a good way to look at it, I guess. Okay. I think the thing is supposed to be up on screen, but it's not. My game's glitched. It's not giving me his strengths or weaknesses. This is awkward. Oh. Okay. So it's Phoenix now. Their biggest lead of the game Great, out to guard Kyrie. So oh my god. Kyrie Irving and J.R. Smith at the guard set. The forwards are LeBron and Thompson. And it's very Zhao in at the center. Phoenix, ah. time either. Should have been my board. He should have drained. Kyrie Irving made his first playoff appearance last season with the Cavs and individually got a big $90 million max extension as well. He's in a really good spot in his career at this point. Okay, well, let's check. Oh, God. Burke reporting from our side God line. dang this it. Game, Doris, take it away. I was going to have to go to Kyrie. In the last matchup against the 76ers, had an off game. He picked up five points and he did some work at the line, drawing a lot of fouls and knocking down the free throws. It was just one of those games where he was a step slow on many plays and couldn't find his groove. We'll see if it was a fluke. I'm taking way too many threes. Here, guys. Great job, Doris. But, like, I have space, so that's you. That's why I'm taking them. Come on. Let's go. Sure thing. I mean, it's always going to be very difficult for them to pull out a win when he has the kind of game he did in that one, guys. And speaking of Irving's star status, last season a signature shoe in his name. I see, in fact, the uh, wow. That's always that's always a big deal. <laughs> All right, Virgil. All right, I see you. That kind of status. He certainly got the flash to go with the substance. Catching up on the changes for Cleveland. Richard oh hey, Jefferson. Mo Williams is back in. And Mo Williams subbed in for Kyrie Irving. Here's Len. God, I hate that hold ball for too long thing. It's so dumb. He has the touch to finish when he's in tight, but not sure on that possession. And the basket good. I like the fact that he led his teammate right to the ideal spot. You don't always throw it to your teammate. You throw it to where he needs to be. Freak kicks to Knight. Use the screen. Freak sets a screen for Knight. Oh, the double screen. Makes that one his sixth of the night. Shooting a very healthy All six right. for nine. Man, he's having quite the quarter converting at a really high percentage. Picked by Verizon. It's Williams with the drive. And foul. Oh. He misses, he'll go to the line. If he would have made that, that and one, hey guys, I would have been upset. Painful one for Anderson Verizon. Uh, he had finally shaken the back injury that sidelined him the year before signs the multi-year contract extension with the Cavs things were starting to look up and only three weeks later he tears the Achilles and was ruled out for the season you talk about a tough break 
I was like, why is he so good at free throws? I should have passed it to Brandon Knight. Oh. Uh, dang it. He can't shoot. Oh. What a savage. I didn't expect him to dunk that. Yeah, and one reason why. I just don't know that I've ever seen him miss a play like that. On the wing, Williams. Here's the three. No. Phoenix grabs the miss. Greg, you're talking about Verizhao. He may play wild, but his production is back a few years ago. I thought that was a good shot. rebounds a game. Yeah, and you know, I don't think he plays that wild. I think he just looks Oh, but J.R. Smith can make that. Okay, game. He's given up his body. I don't know if he's necessarily a wild player as much as he just looks and appears to be everywhere at all times. What are you doing? Why would... In what world would you think that was a good pass? And that one hits back iron. The defense better not make a habit of giving him that shot. I mean, he doesn't miss many of them. The wow, that seven. was a travel and a half, but has got his second bucket of the game to go. And that's his we'll slide. the ability to find his way through the D and finish at the rim. Williams kicks to Thompson, and down it goes, jamming that one home. Well, Clark, we've seen the lead change hands quite a bit in this one. Yeah, we sure have. I mean, it's been a bit of a windshield wiper game. I mean, back and forth, the lead has gone five times. So okay, I got to get it out so I don't get the whole ball too long thing. All right, don't use the screen. Just a matter who can catch that moment. Oh, I was like, did I really just miss that? Great make off an assist. Great ball movement. I was about to be super upset if I missed that. To end the quarters. Oh, come on. Hit me. Hit me. Hit me too late. Jesus, man. I'm like wide open. And he doesn't pass it to me. Alright. <sighs> <sighs> From the free throw. All right, Booker gotta hold it. Oh wait, no, I can't hold it because I'll get the whole ball too long thing. I didn't expect that result when he stepped up there. I'll bet he didn't either. As good a foul shooter as he is. Lawrence passes to Oh God. Five to shoot. Okay, we're good. close to picking that one off. Still a nice play to make sure that pass didn't reach its target. And Phoenix has possession. Their biggest lead the oh, that would have been so nice. But instead, he goes from highlight reel to the bloopers. Oh my God, that would have been amazing. I knew he was gonna miss that though. Oh, yo, this is my jam. And a chance now to send you over to Doris Burke, standing by on the sideline. Doris. Gentlemen, I'm here with Brandon Knight. And Brandon, how right. do you break down this game so far and what you guys need to do in the second half? Uh, you know, we're moving the ball really well right now. And, uh, you know, really finding an open man. So, uh, you know, I got to congratulate my team in the first half just on, you know, moving the ball and really playing unselfish. And, uh, but the main thing is getting stops. And it's going to come down to getting stops to win this game. All good things to sustain for the second half, Brandon. Thank you so much. Guys, over to you. Thank you, Doris. All right, we're actually beating the Cavaliers by one at halftime. Thought we were gonna get destroyed. Yeah, no one cares about stupid halftime thing. And now the start of the second half. Neither side jumping out ahead through the first two quarters. Some excellent numbers in this one. And the Suns with a completely new group on the floor. JR Smith's it's doing the Kyrie Cleveland. thing again. Williams oh, we're winning by nine now. Wow. Uh, awkward. Come on. Just hurry up and let me take it out. Or maybe they're taking out. Yeah. Here's Irving. He's got 15. Lawrence in at point guard. Alex Len out there with Henry Sims. Then it's John Luer and it's Booker oh. at two. Oh. The line up on the floor for the Suns. Fast break here. That defense was amazing. Oh my god. It's just 
just amazing defense all around. Beno Udra. They are as reliable so as trash. the line as you're going to find in this league. And that's something we've come to expect from the point guard position. Yeah, typically you're going to find your best free throw shooters at that point guard spot. But it doesn't happen automatically. I mean, these fellows are consistently working and practicing to keep that percentage as high as it is. Anderson Verizhaus checked in for Mozgov. And on the bench for the Suns, it is Jeff Oh, Anderson. got him with that pump. Wow. For coaches. In the league. He'll be your I wasn't even like that good of a pump. Clear. He still got him. Here's Lawrence. And one. Let's go. Call the foul, ref. In the game. And they are trying to put the hammer down, attacking the rim whenever they can. On the wing, Irvin. Pick by Verizon. Look at that defense. Smith kicks to love. Screen by Smith. Just five to shoot. Oh God. On its way, oh God. Two, oh. And it's Phoenix with the rebound. Sims has got three rebounds now in this one. Good ball movement here by the Suns. Here's the screen. Here's Lawrence. And one. Oh. And Come on. The Cavaliers trail by 11. I'm not getting like any calls. Williams with a the board. Look. Yes, and it's or not. picking up the assist. Irving's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Dimes. I was going to say, please don't miss that. To the hoop there. Easy bucket. We've seen that far too many times today. Irving kicks to love. Wow. And the shot is good. That was probably some of the worst de defense I've ever seen took advantage of in the 2K game. Defense there. They've got to at least get a finger on it. Sims kicks to Booker. Freak dishes the land. Go to work. Or no. The pass to Lawrence. Len with a screen on Irving to the middle and stole I had to get rid of it. And now oh God. Break. Finish off the break. Irving's got 10 points here in the second half. The points just keep coming for him this quarter. And just at the right time, too, as they try to narrow the deficit. Hit me. Oh, my God. And Don't hit me. I swear. Takes the 13 -footer. I didn't want to take that. I wanted to go in for a layup. <laughs> this game, bro. Get out of my... Oh, my God. Sinking right through off the back iron. And really, the scoring this quarter has been just off the charts, doing all he can to bring him back. Why are they double teaming me? What? 58 seconds left to play here in the third. Lawrence passes to Len. Come on. Takes all right. Oh, that's an assist. He took like one dribble. He's got his second bucket of the game to go. Should be an assist. Here's Smith. Good, and the assist goes yes. to Irving. You can see that they're not as aggressive from the three-point arc. They had far more attempts in the first half. Here's Lawrence. That's a foul. Oh my God. Verizhao's got his third rebound on the night. The Cavaliers trail by four. Double team. Over in the corner, Williams fires the three. Phoenix grabs the miss. Hit me, hit me. Pass, 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 pass. Okay. Or don't. No. About three seconds between shot and game clock. Yeah, no, pass it to me when I'm not open. That's cool. God, why are none of my shots going in? So dumb. I didn't want to take the last shot. That was really dumb. Like, three of those shots. In that quarter, should have gone in. Hey, we won by four, which is that's good, I guess. Yeah, it appeared to me as though the fans gave them the emotional boost they needed down the stretch. We beat the Cavs. We beat LeBron James. And time now to go courtside as we said. Which is always impressive. Okay, 600 ABC. I'll take it. I'll take it.
greater success. I don't care. You already talked to Brandon Knight. I better get player of the game. I had like 18 points. Hi again, everybody. This is Ernie Johnson, joined by Shaquille O'Neal and Kenny the Jet Smith. Time now to present our Jordan player of the game, Eric Bledsoe. Aw, come on. Ernie was finally a bright spot for them because, you know, they had a very rough stretch of games. It's been a while since their last win, and he was not content on playing a supporting role. In that I don't care. And that brings us to it wasn't the me. Broadcast for so this do evening. it doesn't even matter. Smith, Hello, Spear. How are you doing? Johnson saying good night, and we'll see you again soon. But yeah, yeah. All right. All right. Twelve points, three rebounds, four assists. Okay, Jesus, 5 for 17 from the field. That's pretty bad.